How is it going everybody? You're watching the Nabal Tech and today I'm going to show you how you can do this. That's right, today I'm going to show you how you can set any song as your iPhone ringtone for free. And when I say any song, I do mean absolutely any song as your iPhone ringtone 100% free. This is absolutely amazing. This video is updated to 2022 and as you can see, I'm running iOS 15. So without further ado, let's get started. So in order to put your favorite tune as your iPhone ringtone for free, we're going to need to use an app called GarageBand. I'm pretty sure you're familiar with GarageBand or maybe have heard of it. And that's because GarageBand is a native Apple application. That means that GarageBand comes pre-installed on any and all iPhones. And as you can imagine, it's a free application. So look for GarageBand on your iPhone. And if you don't see it, that's probably because you have deleted it, but no problem because you can easily download it again via the App Store. So open up the App Store, go to search, search for GarageBand and download it, as I said, it's a free Apple native application. Now that we all have GarageBand, all you gotta do is open it up. And then as you can see, it's a landscape application. So let me just rearrange here and readjust so it'll be easier for us to have a look. And this is the first screen you'll see when you open up GarageBand. It says keyboard, but that's not what we want, all right? So slide to the right a few times until you see audio recorder because that's exactly what we want. So then tap on audio recorder and then this interface will show up and now just follow my steps, all right? The first thing you need to tap is on this icon right here, the metronome icon. As you can see, it's highlighted in blue. So tap on that and then it'll be white and we need it to be white if you don't wanna get disturbed by the metronome, all right? Then the second button you need to press is the third icon from left to right it looks like a little brick wall, all right? So tap on this icon, third one, tap on that, and then that's how we're gonna work. We're gonna use this to actually work and create our ringtone. Next, you're gonna tap on this little plus icon on a teeny tiny plus icon right there at the top right hand corner. It's almost invisible, but you need to tap on that, tap on the plus, and then you'll see here section A, eight bars automatic. All right, so tap there on eight bars. And then you'll see that it says automatic. You need to disable this function and then you need to manually adjust from eight to 30. Uh, those numbers actually represent seconds and we need to get 30 seconds to create our ringtone, all right? So when you see 30, we're good. So you can tap on this little gray area, tap here, and then we have selected for 30 seconds we're good to go, we're good to actually add the song that we wanna turn into a ringtone, all right? So in order to do that, you're gonna to need to tap on this little loop icon. So it's the second icon from right to left, the little loop, tap there. And then as you can see, here is where we're gonna select the file, the song, all right? So you can tap on files, and then here is where we can select it. On yours, if it's the first time you do it, you won't see anything here. So you need to go ahead and tap here on browse items from the files app. It's super important to let you know that you can actually select absolutely any audio file that you want. It doesn't necessarily need to be a song. It can be a homemade audio. Uh, it can be something you download from the internet. It can be something you already have on your iPhone. It just has to be an audio file. And as you can see, it works with AIFF, WAV, CAF, AAC, of course, MP3. So pretty much any audio file that you have in any format will work here on GarageBand and you can actually use to create your ringtone. So tap on browse uh, items from the files app, the last option right here, and then you're gonna select your file using the files app. If you're not really familiar with the files app, if you don't know how to use it, I have a dedicated video here on the channel and I'll put a card right there so you can go ahead, click on that card and take a look at that video because I teach you 
absolutely everything you need to know in order to use the files app now that we're on the files app you just select your audio your song so the idea here is that you download your favorite song your favorite music from the web download it to the files app and then you can simply select it and then we're going to create it in the GarageBand app all right super easy so i have done this and i have um previously downloaded this song right here which is a song you heard in the intro so i'm going to tap on that and then as you can see it'll be added right here it was just added right there perfect and then at this point all i have to do is tap and hold and slide to our work area right here all right so i'm gonna tap and hold and then slide and then align it at the very beginning so then i can let go and then as you can see here i have my song perfect ready to be created as a ringtone another thing that's super important is you can easily edit and select where the song will begin and where it'll end as well and if you want to add it so you can select a, a portion of that song that you prefer you can do it all you got to do is double tap and then slide and then you can easily rearrange as you guys can see very easily but i don't want to do it i want to get it from the top from the beginning so i want it as it is and if you want to test it out just to make sure it's correct all, right, all you got to do is tap on the play button and then it'll play just like that all right so as you guys can see it's perfect it's ready that's my song that's the song i want to turn into a ringtone and now all i gotta do is actually create it in order to do it all i gotta do is tap on the little arrow pointing down as you can see it's the first icon from the left to the right so the arrow pointing down and then tap on my songs as i tap here on my songs it'll just save and then create a song as you can see it's called my song 2 just because i have done this previously but as you can see it's from today from this time so that's my song and then all i have to do is tap and hold and then i just tap on share as i tap on share it'll give me three options and of course the option that we want is ringtone so tap on ringtone and then continue it'll just say it'll be adjusted uh for 30 seconds that's perfect so continue and then you can actually select the name of your ringtone i'm gonna put as uh ringtone i'm gonna put it as ringtone 2 just because i already have one all right so then i'm gonna export and then it's exporting as ringtone it'll take about five seconds to do it it's super fast so let it do its thing and then as you can see it was successful you can tap on ok and then you're done you're absolutely done you can exit GarageBand and you can actually go ahead and have a look at your ringtones so just slide to the left go on settings then scroll down to sounds and haptics and then ringtone and as you can see ringtone 2 as we have just created it tap on ringtone 2 and then there we have it the audio is perfect perfect quality and we have done it guys we have just created a ringtone of absolutely any song for free all right so that's it and i'll see you in the next video as usual bye bye